everyone welcome or welcome back to my channel so first off my dog barked but first off um thank you guys so much for the support on my last video i don't know for sure but i think um the last time i checked i had like 40,000 views um the most i've ever had before that was like a thousand and that was within a year so thank you guys so much for all of that and i gained over 400 subscribers which is insane because the night before i posted that video i only had 33 subscribers so thank you guys so much for the people that are already subscribed from before that video and for everyone that joined into this new little family that we have so i'm so excited that you guys are here and if you are not already subscribed go ahead and okay. do that so Today I am going to be showing you guys the clothes that I bought for school. I start school in about a week from today, a little less. I start on Thursday and when I'm filming this, it is Friday. So this video should be up around Saturday, maybe Sunday. So we'll see. But if it's not, <laughs> don't roast me, guys. Okay, it takes a lot. But anyways, um, I went to three different stores to buy my stuff and that was Aeropostal, H&M, and then Goodwill, actually. So, I'm going to start with Aeropostal. Starting with Aeropostal, I got two items, and that was pants and a shirt. Okay, okay actually, first I got one thing from Forever 21, and that's just no-show socks to wear with vans and stuff. So, that's the first thing. Also, I just want to say, I came back from cheer practice and today was like a themed practice kind of, and we had to wear purple. So I just want to say, this is not what I typically wear. So, yeah, anyways. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's the first item. The, f I guess, first item from Aeropostal though that I got were these pants right here. They are so, so cute. They're a light washed pair of jeans and they have rips along the like knees and then a little up there and i just think that they are so cute and these are just regular boyfriend jeans and let's see i got them in an eight regular these were originally 59.65 but my sister also bought a pair so um here i have the receipt let's see boyfriend jeans so originally 59.95 but it was 28.41 so I think that's really nice for a pair of jeans. It's a good deal. Personally, I don't like spending $50 on jeans, so definitely go when there's sales. So the next thing that I got, <laughs> you kind of saw, is this shirt right here. And it is looking a little rough on camera, but I actually really like it. So it is a relaxed fit, as you can see, and originally $44.95 but final price it turned out to be $22.48 because it was 50% off so here is what it looks like and I just thought that this would be really cute to wear over like simple shirts it would just be a really easy and cute fit so I got that and I got it in a size large so it's a little bit more oversized and then here are the little buttons okay so the next store that i went to i actually went to today and that was h m okay so the first thing that i got is actually jewelry and here it is i don't have my helix pierced and i'm not wearing earrings right now but um these are like fake helix piercings almost um let's see does it actually have a name no it does not but it was 5.99 and one is missing because i gave one to my sister but here's what they look like. Um, $5.99. So the next thing that I got from there was also jewelry. And it is just a really cute necklace. There we go. Let's see if you can see that. It is so cute. It has like a little middle charm right there. There we go and then it is gold i actually have been wearing silver for the past few months but i think i'm gonna try out gold for now and this was also 5.99 um the next thing i bought was just some simple socks and i just got them all white because that's easiest 
And then from H&M, I really just stuck to basic things because I think sometimes I have a lot of shirts and stuff, but I don't really have basics to make an outfit. So that is what I got. So I got this tank top. It's a little cropped, but I kind of like that. So this is the back. And then this is the front. And I got this in a size medium and it was $5.99. That's actually a really good deal. So if you guys have an H&M near you, I'd recommend going because it's really good for basics in my opinion. And according to the tag, it is 23% recycled cotton, 23, oh, <laughs> that's just in French. Okay. <laughs> so here it is once again. And then I got that exact same shirt, but in like a creamy white. Here it is. And then that's the back. Um, once again, it was $5.99 and I got both of those in a size medium. So the next top that I got is also a basic shirt and it is just like this t-shirt and again it's cropped. Well not like super cropped, but slightly cropped. <laughs> um, and this was $5.99 too and I got this in a size large because I don't really love super tight things with sleeves. I don't know if you guys, if you guys are like me, I don't really... I'm a texture person, <laughs> so if it doesn't feel right, I don't like to wear it. And here it is, and it kind of has like a mock neck almost, I don't know if you can tell, but yeah, that is what it looks like. So that's everything that I got at H&M, and now for the Goodwill portion. So. Um, I think a week ago I went to Goodwill with my friend and I found a lot of things and then I returned there on my way home to the beach We stumbled across one so we just decided to go there So I will now show you guys that because it is the majority of my try on haul My try on haul <laughs> I said that really thing that I got was just some jeans that I found and I thought that they have a lot of potential it doesn't look that way on camera, but I really thought that it looked so cute. And this is by the brand Ink. I'm not sure. And it is the regular fit. And is it is in a size 10. And it actually does fit a little bit big on me because I'm mostly an eight for jeans. Anyways, here is the jeans. And then at the bottom, they have these little like bow things. I don't know, it's kind of weird, but I think you can just tuck it in or maybe even cut it off. Um, I think it'd still be cute if you just cut it off and then there's just like this little V, but I have yet to decide, so we'll see. The next thing that I got is a little weird if you look at it first, but I had this vision, I had this vision in my head when I saw it and that would go really well with the white tank top I showed earlier. And that is this grandma EU sweater. So I know when you look at it at first, it's a little old looking, but I feel like it would be really, really cute with just some jeans and a basic shirt. And these actually had shoulder pads when I first bought it, but I cut them out since. And this is by Sag harbor dress and it is in a size i don't know <laughs> it doesn't say so but here's what the brand is and then here's what it looks like and there's even some cool little buttons i don't know if you guys can see that but yeah the next thing that i got i don't necessarily regret getting but i don't really love the fit of it so personally I like to have a lot of things oversized but this one's just a little too oversized <laughs> so it is this shirt right here do you guys see how long it is it's almost as long as the jeans that I got and it just says Cape Cod it's actually in really good condition but it is in a size extra large and it's really really big but I thought that it'd be really cute if you wore it with some leggings and it'd be a perfect fit for like the fall or winter because that's like the majority of the school year. So yeah, but I really do like the color of it. And if I end up not wearing it, I'm just gonna donate it again. So the next thing that I got is also an oversized shirt that I intend to wear with leggings. And it is my water bottle. And it is this shirt 
right here. It looks really big too, but for some reason I like this one a lot more. So there's a few buttons in the front. This one's unbuttoned, <laughs> but it is a navy color and it is by Boston Traders. And it's actually in a larger size. It's an XXL. <laughs> um, but this one for some reason is bigger than this one. So I don't know, sizes are weird in America. Maybe everywhere else too, I don't know. But I really like this one because it has like a fleece inside and that just will be perfect for the winter or the fall when it gets chilly. And it would just look so cute. With just like some leggings and some cute sneakers. So yeah. And then the last thing that I got that day was this super cute grandpa sweater. So here, oh, it looks so good on camera too. Um, the colors are a little bit darker in person, but it is by the brand Trickett Saint Raphael, and it is in a size large, large. <laughs> um, here is what it looks like. I will say it kind of like cinched up at the bottom when I had it drying. I didn't have a hanger at the time, so I kind of just left it out to dry. And I don't know if I put it in a wrong position or something, but um, anyways, it's okay. It's still cute. And I think it would look so cute with some like jeans or even leggings, but I think it would look better with jeans. Um, so yeah, that is the last thing that I got from that Goodwill. And then I have two more items that I bought yesterday at the other Goodwill. So the first item that I bought was this super cute like crew neck sweatshirt thing i don't even know but i don't exactly know what this logo is for but when i saw it it was brand new and originally 50 dollars, and i only bought it for like 4.49 um the prices of these stuff from Good goodwill i'm not 100 percent sure how much everything was but i know in total for those items it was around 30 dollars um this is by rusty and it is in a size large but it fits like an extra 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 large it is really big which i did not expect so the sleeves go to about here's my arm it goes to about here <laughs> like way further down so i have to roll it up but i don't mind because it looks really cute anyways and then again this has like the fleece inside which is just perfect for um i was gonna say summer for like winter and fall and i think this would look absolutely adorable with some leggings because it's just so cute and you can fold it up so that is honestly one of my favorites because it's in great quality and it was brand new when i saw it okay so the last thing that i have for this haul is this shirt that i found at goodwill yesterday and here it is <laughs> I don't know if you guys like this or not, but I really like it. I think it would look so cute with some, I don't know, some nice shoes and then like some cute light jeans like the ones that I bought. And this is in a size 10 and it is by Ann Taylor. Pretty popular store. So here it is once again. And then <laughs> I didn't realize this when I first put it on, but there's actually like a zipper on the side so that's kind of funny because i just put it on like that and the detailing is so cute i don't know if you guys can tell but everything's like embroidered on. okay guys i can't even lie to you i started that video i mean not the video i started the try on portion but um i have a lot of things to try on and i don't really feel like doing that i had a seven hour long practice today because it was choreo day i'm tired if you guys want to see me try on all these different things, let me know. I can definitely do a try on haul, but this video is already going to be long enough. So I'm just going to leave you guys and I hope you enjoyed this video because I actually did enjoy it. I, I love shopping. So <laughs> um, anyways, I am going to see you guys on the first day of school. That's going to be the next video. It's going to be a get ready with me for the first day of my sophomore year. And then after that video, it's going to be get ready with me for my first friday night lights which is a football game i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'm so excited to see you guys in the next one because i start school in less than a week and that's just crazy to me and in one week i'm gonna be at my football game my first one that's insane to me too so 
anyways, wish me luck, guys, and good luck to any of you guys who are going out there and starting school too. I know it can be scary, but keep your masks on and try your hardest. Okay, anyways, I will see you guys on my first day of school. Bye!